Amazing new time zone of reality, everyone. My name is Vel here at Science Away, and today we are assembling another thing from 4D Fame Master, but it is not an anatomy set. This is a 4D puzzle. So it's still an animal, but you're just assembling it, kind of like a 3D jigsaw puzzle in a way. This is the Octopus Siamensis. Please let me know if I'm saying anything wrong in the comments below and tell me how to say it correctly. So what's interesting about this is, like I said, it's not an anatomy set, it is just a puzzle. So there are all kinds of little pieces that need to go together and then you put more pieces together to make this little, I would almost call it a decoration because this is not a toy. You wouldn't go play around with this in like the sandbox or rough house with it basically. It's pretty decorative, I would say. Yes, you could role play with it, but I definitely wouldn't go like, <laughs> playing around with it with cars and things like that. It's really not a toy in that sense. It's got 26 pieces and it's actually pretty fun to put together. It can be a little tricky at times to figure out which arms go for which holes. There are instructions on the back, however, usually in the anatomy sets anyway, there are these little pamphlets this time, it's on the back of the box. And it's just got little images. So, I mean, I guess that's kind of part of the puzzle, trying to figure out which pieces go where. And we have short information available to us on the back of the box here. Just like the pamphlets in the anatomy sets, you get a whole like, Q&A section and then each part has its own information section. This time we just got a little piece of it. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and read that while I am assembling the octopus. So the scientific name is Octopus Simensis. Common names are Crake. It's not Kraken, but it's spelled pretty similar. It's basically Kraken, but without the N. So I'm just, I'm saying like it's Crack or Crake. And then the next common name is Pulpo or Pulpa. I found out when I was trying to look up how to pronounce it, that is Octopus in Spanish. If that's incorrect, please let me know. And then family is Octopodidae. And then the estimated size, we have no data on this apparently. Now I'm just reading what's on the back of the cards here. I have not Googled these yet, but I thought it'd be interesting just to read what's on the back of the cards. That way, those of you who maybe don't have this kit yet, just kind of know what you're in for. And I'm not showing the, the box on screen. So this is just a little bit of information. And then where to find them is Eastern Indian Ocean. Their diet consists of shrimp, crab, and small fish, and apparently their lifespan is four years or longer. So, and that's literally it. There's no Q&A section or anything like that. I think this is kind of the, maybe like a smaller kit. The anatomy sets are puzzles, but this is more intended to be a puzzle as well, I feel. You know, I just think it's more of a fun little thing to do so you get the bonus of an octopus while doing a fun puzzle. And what is the same though, they have a timed section. So beginner is 20 minutes, average is 15, and advanced is 10 minutes. So on the back, you can write what your record is of how long it took you to assemble it. I think that's kind of fun. It's a little different. You know, I could see if you had like several of these at either like a party or, you know, just have your friends over and just kind of, you know, see who can assemble it the fastest and learn about octopuses. And for those of you who are going to say it's octopi, it, it is not octopi. Technically, both are correct. It can be octopi or octopuses. So don't come for me in the comments, okay? <laughs> so let me know if, if, if any of you have gotten this puzzle for yourselves or whoever, and what did you thought about when it came to assembling it? This took me pretty much 21 minutes to assemble. Definitely the trickiest part was figuring out which arms go where. The assembly instructions do tell you, but it can be a little different when you actually get to assembling it. Some arms didn't fit correctly. So I don't know, it was pretty interesting. I did struggle a little bit. But overall, I had fun, and now I have a cute little octopus to sit on my desk. And honestly, I thought it was fun. It's a quick little thing to do, and you get to learn a little bit about octopuses. Anyway, this was just a short little thing to watch. Hopefully you enjoyed. Let me know what other 40 puzzles I should get. I am getting more anatomy ones in the future, but I want to see 
which ones you all want to see me do next when it comes to the 40 puzzles. There is a lot more 40 puzzles than there are anatomy sets. They do have a ton, but trust me, I looked to the website, there's a lot more 40 puzzles. So let me know which ones you want to see next. I do have some in mind, but it'll be interesting to see what's the highest requested. Anyway, I will see you all later. Thank you for watching. Bye.